que aquí vamos la entrevista sobre el BMW i3, el auto eléctrico que ha ganado dos premios en el Auto Show de Nueva York. Well, Jacob, uh, congratulations. Uh, you just added a couple of uh, decorations for your stand here at the New York Auto Show. <laughs> It's a great way to start the morning. Yeah. <laughs> so the i3, uh, green car of the year and design car of the year. Um, I guess uh, since you put like so much effort in putting these cars together, you always expect good things. But were you expecting both? Um, both, no. I think green, I was uh, as confident as you could be going into it, given um, all the sustainability, innovation, thought process from Cradle to Grave that went into the i3. I think we are truly industry leading with that. The design, um, I was. I turned to one of my colleagues and was like, I really want design. <laughs> and um, and we got it. So that that's the one that's um, icing on the cake, I'll yeah, say. Congratulations on both. Uh, and, and for the audience who has not known much about the, the i3, let, let's talk about a little bit. What makes it revolutionary? Um, it's purpose-built and truly purpose-built to maximize a, an electric uh, powertrain. Uh, we've industrialized carbon fiber, so for a price point of $41,350 before any federal or state tax incentives, um, that is a huge revolutionary step forward for the industry. Um, you have all the driving dynamics and things you'd expect from a BMW. In an electric car, I drive one here in Manhattan every day, and taxis hate me. I win every traffic light to traffic light race, and all the performance you'd expect. Um, and then, again, as I touched on earlier, the sustainability, all the materials that went into it, not only the carbon fiber, everything inside is recyclable or made of recyclable or, or renewable materials. Um, the fit and finish, the interior volume, it's just a true total package and that's why we're so proud of this car. Yeah, uh, I had the opportunity to go to your headquarters here in New Jersey uh, the, earlier this week and we saw not only now the, how it's made but also how it could be repaired because if putting carbon fiber in a car, most people may be scared like, oh, I mean, like, it's going to be impossible to fix. But you have even thought about that, that process is also. Yeah, it's amazing. So there's nine cut points around the, uh, the passenger compartment, the carbon fiber passenger compartment. If you have a damaged area, you bring it to one of our uh, certified collision repair centers. They will literally cut out the damaged area and then rebond in a new one. It's truly like space age new things. It's hard for people to wrap their head around, Entirely. as you said. Um, but we did benchmark it against a, a one series, a traditional one series, and it is um, on par, if not a uh, little less, actually, to repair a i3 than a one series. Yeah, and then on the design part of it, uh, completely different from anything out there, starting with the truly. doors, the way they open, yeah. and the, the use of materials inside. Exactly. Um, a truly progressive design. Um, it is, and then the To win this award is so uh, vindicating, and um, yeah, it has coach doors, not suicide doors, coach doors. Yeah. So it uh, helps making and getting in and out of the car incredibly easy. I like to think I'm six feet tall. I can get into the back seat without even having to move or adjust the, the seat forward. And then, uh, as you said, the materials inside. So we use um, hemp for the da door panels and the dash. There's recycled water bottles and the fabric for the seats. We use eucalyptus when we use wood. Um, it's a very an abundant resource. It grows like a weed, which is a good thing. The leather, when we do use leather, is, tied, is dyed using olive oil. Mm -hmm. So it's, a, again, a comprehensive thought process. A green car through all uh, Every everything step of the in way. and out. Yeah. And uh, so the car has uh, gone to sell already in the States? Uh, we're about two weeks out. Okay. So we're at the precipice. This is a good boost to win these two awards. <laughs> exactly. Right at the, as the and car then he, we're sitting here at your uh, exhibit here at the New York Auto Show, and there's the other one. Yes. Next to it, the i8, which uh, is coming out, right? Yes, summertime for the i8. Um, incredible design, form-following function. Everything that makes the i3 great is embodied in the, in the i8 as well. Use of carbon fiber, renewable and recyclable materials throughout. And then we like to think of this as the, the sports car of the future. So do you think this is going to win three next year? I think we can, I think we can sweep. <laughs> we could probably get all four and car of the year, actually. Well, that's a, that's a good uh, goal. Well, now we've set the benchmark, right? So, <laughs> so what are you doing for me lately? Excellent. Well, thank you very much, Jack, your man. Congratulations again. Pleasure. Thank, thank you very you much. Este programa fue una producción de National Latino Broadcasting.